Okay, guys, um, STR Gogeta ZZA came out today. I can't even say, like, recently, recently anymore, because it's like 5 p.m. Came out probably 14 hours ago. I don't know why you need to know that, but, you know, you do, in case if you ever need to. <laughs> um, this is the team that I've been using to go through it. Um, I wish that I had, like, different units, but I've bobbed the wrong units at the wrong time. Like, I think I pulled Agility Bojack once. And I think I would throw him on here over 17. Uh, mine's almost rainbowed, but either way, he's not tanking great. Um, and that, the only reason he's really here is because he's an agility and it has damage reduction. I do have the cooler from the Baba Shop, and by the time I get to like level 45, I might try him here. But as of right now, it doesn't even really matter. Um, the main damage dealer on this team is definitely the Great Ape Turles, though. Uh, I actually just put Kai's into him yesterday for this EZA. And he actually, like, impressed me with how much damage he was able to do. And if he transforms into a great ape, he just kills Gogeta. Like, it takes both turns, but if you get lucky with Key, he can just kill Gogeta by himself, like, without taking any damage. That's, like, that's how I feel like you could get really far in this easy A. It's like, you start off with Turles, and he transforms. And then, as soon as that Turles isn't transformed anymore, you after one turn, you get damaged a lot. And then... Uh, Tapion can transform, because Tapion is a very good defensive unit for this. So I'm actually going to leave Tapion right there. Even though... Did I... I didn't float the Turles last rotation, did I? The Great Ape Turles is only so great if he's not alongside another Turles, because he doesn't have all of his links activated. Like, here's a tax that's going to be at about 1.1 mil. But since he's on the movie boss category, he's going to do probably like 1.5 or something. Um... How much is he going to take for this? He's not going to take much. And 10k. And if by some miracle we made it below 50% HP, he has a 100% chance to transform. 1.7 crit. So, funny story about that Turles. I actually used to have him like reversed. Because the way that I sort my box, it's like... I think it was by attack and then by cost. Um, actually, I think it was by attack and then level and then cost. Um, so the Turles, because, like, team cost is so high, he was always near the top, but he wasn't SA-10, and he didn't have, like, any dupes or anything, so I just had him reversed until yesterday, and I was like, man, F it, I'll put some Kai's into him, and, to be honest, I don't regret it, because he's, like, molly whopping this EZA. Now, because I'm talking, I'm not really thinking, I should have put Golden Freeze in that last slot. Um, and at the end of this video, we are going to be doing my last summon on the Gogeta banner. Here's hoping that it goes well, because if it doesn't, man, this Gogeta banner really did shaft me. See, like, this is what I'm talking about from, uh, Super 17. Like, I know that he isn't on the category, so he's only getting, like, the 50% buff. But either way, I feel like he could be tanking better, because he does have damage reduction. And also, I steered Nimbus just here to block. I feel like, hmm. See, it's a give and take right now since Injinimba doesn't have his easy A. I thought about using Injinimba because he has a bit of a defense buff. And I have more dupes of him and his defense is higher. Um, but STR Jinimba can dodge. And I think I may have given him dodge in the potential system. I really don't know. Um, but anyways. Oh, we're starting to get Rainbow Awakening Medals. See, we got 48 stones. So, by the end of this video, we're going to have like 51, 52 or something. I didn't do math. It's just close to that. Uh, so gonna be my final multi of this celebration and oh my god has it sucked um since the video where i was like showcasing the super saiyan gods on super battle road i have pulled a dupe of the super saiyan god goku but i don't sound happy about that because i'm not um so since that video actually i have done eight multis uh of those like out of those eight multis I got one Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, who I already had rainbowed. I've pulled, like, three extra copies of him. And I have also pulled uh, that one Super Saiyan God Goku. And uh, those are the only good units that I've pulled. Like, a lot of people, when they're comparing Dokkan versus Legends, they're like, oh, but Dogon has a guaranteed SSR. But it's like, that keeps you from feeling shafted, but you can still be shafted. And this is coming from a person who has only opened Legends, like, four times. But, actually, I did open it, like, for the first time in a long time, uh, just a few days ago, because of the Super Saiyan God Vegeta, uh, summons, 
I got shafted. Haven't opened it since. I think I'm level like four. I downloaded it on its like first day out too. Tapion is one of the best units for this. I actually remember when the Family Coming High Easy came out, I didn't have Turles. So the way that I beat level 30 of that EZA was I brought a double Tapion team. I used my Tapion as leader and I brought the friend's Tapion and I got two uh, Haruduron transformations and that was how I beat it. And this right here is a dub if we can get supers because this guy is pretty good especially if he gets any crits or additionals. I love it that they gave that update to giant form units. I also like that they got rid of you having to move it around because I was always really confused with like where I had to move Hoomps. Yeah, they, we aren't going to kill him here. Because we didn't get lucky with Key. Like, we got lucky enough for one super, but that's only 800k. It's going to do about a milli, yeah. He got an additional, but it was normal. Give me an additional super. Not quite. Alright, we got this turn two. That's one super. Can we get another? Maybe? Nope. <laughs> we tried. Uh, this is going to get Gogeta onto maybe his last life bar, depending on how the, the potential system treats us. Crit? Nope. Additional? Nope. Okay, no matter what, we are going to get him onto his last life bar, though. And if our HP was low now, we would go right into a Harutagarn. That's why this easy, I feel like you can go pretty far in if you've got a good team. Um, nope. Oh, we got a third turn. That's fine. Uh, I don't know. Is it like a 50% chance that you get the third turn or is it less? I have no idea. And there goes Gogeta this time. This is actually taking longer than I thought it would. I'm going to be real. Because whenever I do the other stages, I'm just kind of on autopilot. Because it's like, I'll do my turn and then I'll like pay attention to whatever I'm doing. And then I'll pick my phone back up a few minutes later and I'll be like, okay, now I'll do this turn. And next thing you know, I'll be Gogeta. Although, in the later stages, you can't do that anymore, but, well, not, like, this, but, like, once you get to, like, past stage 60, I feel like I might need to pay attention. Um, this is a very defensive rotation to start out. Dang it, we, whenever we don't get a uh, Great Ape Turles with the Dokkan Fest Turles, it's kind of a rip, because, well, it's not a rip, like, we're gonna die, but it's, like, it would be nice to get them together, just because otherwise that Turles doesn't share like any key links, and he's not getting any key from the other Turles' passive, so, you know, it's upsetting. Although this de rotation is very good for defense. We got the double super from the friend Turles, let's go. My Turles does not have any dupes, um, but I don't feel like that's going to matter too terribly much in this EZA. Mm, just cause, like, if you can find a friend that has dupes, <laughs> and... I feel like some people, when they woke up this morning, they forgot the SDR Gogeta EZA came out. They like sorted their friends by movie boss category, and they were just like, what happened? Because like I, I knew the Gogeta EZA came out, but because I have Broly and I don't have Gogeta, I just always have my friends list sorted by um, movie bosses category. Uh, that, either, well, it's either that or like whatever event has an extra drop rate on the event that I'm farming up. I said that wrong, but either way, um, uh, but I just had it sorted by movie bosses, and then I was, like, just trying to hop into the orb event, and all I saw was Turles's, and I was like, oh, Gogeta's easy is up, I see. How much is this gonna do, dodge? Nope. See, like, we got the two faux tanks on this rotation, so that kind of sucks. Actually, he didn't do too terribly bad. Um, Millie? Okay, wait. Did we float off? I don't think we floated off the other Turles. If the other Turles doesn't transform, they can link. Hey, they can link. Um, you know what? We're gonna do this. And it was the friend's Turles that transformed, which is, like, ideal. I should have given him those agility orbs to heal us a little bit, but it doesn't really matter. Now, this Turles is going to hit very hard. <laughs> uh, he could even do 2 million damage. I don't know. We'll see. One thing I don't like, though, is, like, as soon as Turles eats the tree might, he's gonna do, like, 3 million, by the way. But as soon as Turles transforms, he has, like, the exact same art as the Great Ape Turles. Like, it's... It's not even, like, different in the slightest. Alright, there's that. How close are we to being done? We're hopping into stage 29. Alright, so two more stages to go. 
because after this we're gonna be on stage 30. And then this triggers me to no end. Why don't you max out your units, people? Like I kind of get it with LRs, because LRs it's like, oh, but I don't have training items, nah. But TRs aren't even hard to train up. You're just being lazy. Um You know that. Then you know that. I'm gonna save those agility orbs for I have no idea who, but we're saving them for someone. How much Charlotte's gonna take? 15k, he's Goji's starting to hit kinda hard. I can see it. I can see where this could be getting difficult soon. If he supers Ooh, he's activating big bad bosses for the Great Ape Terrorless. I get that I don't even see this as like a negative. Yeah, big bad bosses was active. I'm so busy looking for big bad bosses I didn't see what his attack stat was. So I assume it was over 1.1, probably like 1.3 or something, but yeah, it was 1.3, you can still see it at the bottom. I actually didn't know you could do that. Turles is already transforming. Um, that's kind of not good though, because he doesn't have any key links. I told you I was saving this key for someone, I just didn't know who yet. Now this is also the friend's Turles, so he might not be max level, but he has two dupes. The New Year's banner blessed me. like. Above, like, the guaranteed LRs, uh, out of all the categories I could have gotten, there were, like, two of them, there were three of them, I think, that I didn't have, and I got two of them. So now there's only, like, one category that was on that banner that I don't have. Off the top of my head, I don't remember who that is, but I remember I didn't have Turles or MVP17. Um, and now I got him, and it feels good, man. Although... It's not like I have MVP 17 like I do on my JP, where I've pulled him four times. And I'm still summoning on that uh, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta banner, like, probably once. Uh, what am I saying once? Probably like five times a day, probably like 25 stones a day, because I'm just like doing missions on my JP, and then it's like, oh, I have enough for a single, I guess I'm gonna go do it. And I'm doing it on the Vegeta banner, because if I can get LR Gogeta, then my JP is looking stacked. Because I will have all of the LRs from the banners. Ooh, was he a 1.5? Wait. Have I under rating STR Janemba? And he dodge. Alright, we're going to have Transform Turtles finish it off. There you go. Wait, is that? Yeah, that is a super. Okay. See, this is going G to EZA. It's still going down pretty easily. We lost like 30k HP there. One thing that really does help though is that, like as soon as Turtles transforms, he covers 10% HP at the beginning of every turn along with his, like, 130% defense buff. Alright, this is gonna be our last run through, then we're gonna do that multi, and we're gonna call it a day. Okay. Level 30. Let's go. I went up with 52 stones, so my quick maths was right. And I'm taking guests, like, that way, just in case, if I run out of guests, then I have my friends to fall back on. Um... Is there a way for me to get him a super? Yeah, there is. Yeah, there is. This is it. Okay, good. Now, unless if one of the Turtles transforms and the other one doesn't, next turn is kind of eh. Because I'm going to have to float one of the Turtles and keep Janemba on rotation, which is never ideal. See, this Turtles is only at 700k without being linked up with the Turtles and his support type passive. <laughs> MVP. Not MVP. Super 17, 260k. Even though he is only on to like a double 50% lead, that's not much. Now, if this is the only Toast that transforms, this is like the best that it could be. Now, if both Toast is transformed, we're kind of shafted. Hey, and it was the friend's Turles too. This is going great. Um, if he gets like an additional super here, we could just be done here. Like, straight up, the last stage could be the one that went down the easiest. 2 million. How much is it gonna do? Will he crit? Will he not? Find out next time on Dragon Ball. Okay, well, he didn't. He didn't even need to wait till next time. Now, even this one's almost at a million. Alright. I would have rather you supered the other one, or STR Janemba, just anyone but this Turles on the rotation, but whatever. Actually, next turn we should have Tapion and Golden Frieza, so we should have a very tanky rotation. And we do, okay. But of course he's attacking everywhere. Uh, we're gonna save those STR orbs over on the right for this Turles. 
Now there's no way that he finishes it here, but next turn it's over. Oh, I'm getting nervous about this multi, because this is my last chance to pull Blue Gogeta. Now, I won't be upset if I... Okay, so I will be upset if I pull Ink Gogeta, because I think I've pulled like 8 Ink Gogetas off of this banner. I will be upset if I pull Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, because I think I have pulled like 6 Super Saiyan 4 Vegetas off this banner. Um, but I would really like... Oh, dang it, the other trailer's transformed. Um, I would really like Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, uh, either of the Super Saiyan Gods, but I would only really be, like, thoroughly happy if I pulled Blue Gogeta, if I'm gonna be honest. Also, because this trailer's transformed, this might not be the last rotation. This guy's gonna tank pretty well. 130% defense on the category. Yeah. Now if you get an additional super, we're done. Nope. Imagine if we lost this one. Additional. Of course mine got the additional, but it was a normal. Now the friend's D evolved? Well, he wasn't really evolved. D8? I guess he got off of his high? I don't know what to call that. Okay. You know, we didn't get a single Haruga in this video, which is neither here nor there, but I think I got one on like stage 23. Like, not the stage before I started recording, the stage before that. Oh, this is gonna do nothing. This is gonna do like 2 damage. 89, whatever. 71. I was waiting for the normal to do more than the super. Okay. Um, now this is gonna be it. This rotation, either way. If it's not the Great Ape Turles, it's gonna be the Dokon Fest. Alright, 1.3. Let's see if we can get him out of here. Not quite. It's gonna have to be the Dokon Fest one. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, so. On Twitter the other day, I saw this guy call his shot, and he missed wildly, but I want to see if I can do it successfully. So basically what he did, all those guys that I don't need because I have in Gogeta, but so basically what this guy did is he clicked on the scouter, and it was on JP, so he clicked on the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta banner, and clicked on Blue Vegeta, because that's what he wanted. So I'm clicking on the scouter, and he didn't get it. But I'm going to. This is the goal. This is what we want. I love you. We're going to watch your super attack. This is what I didn't do. This is why I didn't get him yet. Whew, okay. Hmm. Man. I'm getting kind of nervous. Okay, let's do it. Last multi on this banner. If not, I guess I'm just going to have to be flying without him. That's a Dokkan Fest exclusive. That is a Dokkan Fest exclusive. Um. How many Dokkan Fest exclusives are on this banner? I know I just talked so fast that wasn't even English. There are five. There are five Dogon Fest exclusives. I have a one in five chance of pulling him. Oh god. It's Int Gogeta. It's Int Gogeta. Oh my god, it's Int Gogeta. Alright guys, that was the last multi on this banner. Because it's like the ninth Int Gogeta I've pulled. If you guys enjoyed this video, please consider I don't even care anymore. Bye guys.